With fleet management, there are several purposes. You have to acquire vehicles, you have to maintain them, and you have to fix them when they break. Currently, we have between 500 to 600 rolling stock, which is between pickups and sedans and fire trucks and all sorts of trash trucks and, and whatnot. There's a lot to do. The fire department takes care of their own stuff for the most part, but we take care of the rest. From trash trucks to lawnmowers to tractors to whatever they bring in, we do the tire work, uh, oil and filter changes, pretty much keep it all going. Uh, this is one of our trash trucks. It's uh, needing serviced. We'll uh, grease the hole underneath of the truck. We'll change the oil and filters. We'll change the fuel filters, the air filters, just to do a complete service work on it. I don't have an exact number, but it's between 525 to 600 of all told vehicles. Now, not all of them have wheels, but uh, we do count certain things like trailers and such like that as rolling stock. Uh, some of them are like jackhammers and stuff like that, that that just get carried on trailers, but are parts of the equipment that we maintain. I'm working on 212, working on the driver arms because they won't go up or down. When it came in, it wasn't opening, it was just closing. So I'm working on electrical on it. I have four mechanics, two technicians in the tire shop that take care of the tires and oil changes and such. I've got one assistant uh, named Karen Key. She takes care of some of the paperwork around here. And then there's me. We are not a, a one-stop shop. Uh, we do take advantage of other people's expertise, such as Stevens Ford for the Ford vehicles, Northcutt for Chevys and such like that.